Only one company in Australia commercially produces magnetite pellets, and only one has both mining and pellet production expertise. Grange Resources is Australia's leading magnetite producer. Grange operates Australia's largest integrated iron ore mining and pellet production business in Tasmania and is developing its world-class magnetite project in Western Australia. The Southdown project near Albany is a significant magnetite project which will firmly establish Grange on both sides of the Australian continent as a major magnetite producer. While the company's Savage River mine in northwest Tasmania is a long-life mining asset, Southdown is forecast to supply up to five times the amount of iron ore over a much longer time frame. Grange's Tasmanian operations, the Savage River mine and its pellet production facility at Port Latter, provide the cash flow, experience and systems necessary for the successful development of Southdown a key difference between Grange and its magnetite peers. The Savage River mine has a resource of 306 million tonnes, most of which will come from the North Pit. A reserve of almost 120 million tonnes graded at over 51% magnetite has extended the life of the mine to 2026. Once mined, Grange's magnetite iron ore is processed into a concentrate slurry and pumped to the pellet plant at Port Latter. The plant produces over 2 million tonnes of premium quality iron ore pellets annually. Grange's current supply contracts with Shigang, China's largest private steel mill, and Australian company Blue Scope Steel are built on its ability to consistently supply premium quality pellets from its Port Latter plant. Since Grange took over the Tasmanian operations, it has delivered a solid performance. The Savage River operations are progressing to plan. This year we've upgraded the mobile fleet and the concentrator, ensuring we can increase production into the future, providing sustainable cash flow for the next 16 years. The infrastructure base at Savage River, comprising the concentrator, pipeline, the pellet plant and the port allow us to explore opportunities with some of the other magnetite projects in the northwest of Tasmania. Creating strategic alliances with those companies to allow them to process their ore through our infrastructure could increase production at Savage River by up to 300,000 tonnes a year. Also, we have a drilling program happening at Long Plains. It's a magnetite deposit about 10 kilometres away from Savage River which could extend the mine life of Savage by up to five years. The Savage River operations are now providing steady cash flow and expertise for development of the Southdown project. Grange's Southdown project is located 90 kilometres northeast of Albany in the southwest of Western Australia. This port city provides a ready workforce as well as many of the services and infrastructure required for the project. The Southdown project has a resource of 654 million tonnes of premium quality magnetite. However, early estimates suggest the potential for 1 billion tonnes over a 12 kilometre strike length. The magnetite will be mined by proven open pit methods. Southdown has a long strike extension and it outcrops to the west. That really has the potential for us to increase production because we can set up multiple work areas. Our expectation with that is we'll be able to lower production costs because it really has a good stripping ratio, it has some excellent ground conditions and the weather in Albany is very favourable to mining operations. And the, one of the biggest advantages we have is a ready-made workforce all ready to go in Albany. Southdown's magnetite resource is sufficient to support a long mine life with annual production rates of up to 10 million tonnes of high quality concentrate containing about 70% iron with very low phosphorus levels, a key requirement of the steel industry. An extensive program of test work and process design has been completed for Southdown and all the mine's approvals are in place. Like Grange's Savage River operation, 
the ore will be crushed and ground before going through a wet magnetic separation process to produce a high-grade magnetite concentrate. The magnetite concentrate, mixed with water, will be pumped to Albany via an underground pipeline. This process reflects what is done at Grange's Tasmanian operation. Once the Southdown concentrate reaches Albany, it will be filtered and stored, ready for shipping. To efficiently and cost-effectively export the concentrate, the Albany Port Authority will upgrade the existing port facilities by reclaiming land for a new berth and deepening the existing shipping channel to accommodate Cape size vessels. At every step, geology, mining and processing, the Southdown project has the added advantage of Grange's in-house magnetite expertise. Today, Grange Resources is the largest magnetite pellet producer in Australia, with margins that rival the world's biggest iron ore exporters. Iron ore prices remain strong. At Savage River, we've got new opportunities and we will continue to see the benefits of cash generation from the Tasmanian operations. As we take South Down to the next stage of development, post DFS, we remain convinced that this project, located as it is near the port city of Albany in Western Australia, has the ability to make Grange a world-class magnetite producer. This world-class project is destined to make Grange one of the region's biggest magnetite exporters. From mining to pellet production, Grange Resources is Australia's leading magnetite producer.